Jeff, welcome to TechWise TV Labs, man. Good to have you here. Thank Jeff, you. Just for the record, thank you for letting me call you Jeff. How do I say your name in French? Uh, it's Jean Francois, but uh, no, for ease of use reason, no, call me Jeff. <laughs> I appreciate that very much, man. I have a hard enough time with English sometimes. <laughs> um, looks like you got a pretty uh, cool looking product here. What is this thing? So this is the new Catalyst 3750 X Series. X Series, okay. X Series. It's our new top of the line stackable fixed configuration switch okay and um, we're just releasing that product today now what's the difference between the 3750x and the e-series so the e-series uh is it, it's basically an improvement over the uh, the e-series that x series has all the feature and capability of the e-series plus a lot more and okay. let me show you the first thing okay see over here we have the network module okay so unlike the e series which has a fixed uh, uplink the x series has no fill replaceable network module so customer can decide if they want any at all and if they decide to have some one gig ten gig and you know in the future we're gonna come up with new modules so and it's just a matter of removing the module inserting the new one and you don't even have to reboot or power up the switch Everything give us longevity in the network exactly one gig, 10 gig, whatever profane. our load is yeah very cool very cool so uh visibly on the front we also have you know that little port over here that's a usb mini b it allows you to um, basically console into the switch so uh, no. no more blue cable huh well we still have the cube uh, the blue cable you know uh, the beloved blue cable it's still difficult to uh, <laughs> to um, go along our way without it but we are still and uh, we have at least added usb the other thing that you don't see here is that all those ports, the user port, they all support uh, MaxX, so 802.1AE. Oh, I love that. That's so cool. So we have special ASICs in the switch that are dedicated to that job. They basically handle all the encryption and decryption of all the traffic coming or going out of those ports. Uh, well, that's important because I, I think it's important to, to kind of uh, to pause on that a second because... The MaxX stuff, you know, putting encryption on networks has always been a pain in the tail, right? It adds a lot of overhead, it's, it, 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 and it's kind of tough. You know, we've got different mixed software and stuff. The MaxX is all done in hardware. It's still AES, but it's GSM, so it's actually designed to run in hardware at line rate. Yes. Right? So basically, the switching fabric and the CPU of the switch are not like impacted at all. We have that, like I said, the dedicated ASIC that handle all the encryption, decryption. So everything is line right now. It's We've been waiting for that a long time. That's very cool stuff. So the other thing, Jimmy Ray, that we have, and we are the only switch that can do that, like uh, we have PUE Plus on the switch to the new 802.3.80 standard, which is backward compatible with the, right. the, the 3AF. So that enables that, that switch to support like the current generation and the future generation of products yeah, that are going... 30 watts per port. 30 watts on a one you, uh, you yes. stackable. That's that's pretty. Uh, we are the only one that does that. So you are we are able to drive like 48 30 watts devices all at the same time, all in one single uh, one. That's RD pretty heavy chassis. duty, man. Yes. So thanks to you now the stack the stack power technology, we are able to combine all the power of two power supply to be able to drive all that load. Sure enough. So, okay. So those are the most visible thing on the front. So if I bring you back. There in the go. back. Okay. So, yeah, see your beloved blue cable. Oh, I got to have that blue cable. <laughs> we have uh, Stackwise Plus. So, uh, 3750 would not be a 3750 without Stackwise. Oh, that's right. That's right. So, this is Stackwise Plus, the same Stackwise as the E series. It's backward compatible with regular Stackwise. So, you can have basically 3750, 3750, and 3750X all in the same stack. Oh, you stack. can mix and match. Yes. Oh, yes. that's cool. Kay. So, you can add X series to your existing network and there are your existing stack all right let me put you on the spot okay because a lot of our competitors also sell stacking what is the definition of stacking well our definition of stacking is basically unifying the uh, the data and the control plane of our switches so when you stack 3750 together it's exactly like you you take the motherboard out of those switch you put them on the table and you run jumper wire between the buses and you unify the motherboard it becomes one single switch 
The competition definition of uh, stacking is most likely going to just, you can pile them on top of each other and you can kind of control them with a special software. We are basically the, a true stackable switch. We're talking more than manageability, we're talking actual controlling and data manipulation yeah, uh, the between, uh, across the entire stack. The, the way the CPU basically control the different switching fabric Sync the forward information base, the TCAM, everything is unified and it basically uh, acts as a single entity. You are not masking the management of a stack with a, a, a software, an independent, independent software. That's Stackwise cool. Plus, you really merge all those switch into one single entity. Awesome. So, uh, other improvement over the E series, so the X series featured two fan module. So we can survive one fan failure, remove, add Field the new replaceable. fan. Field replaceable, gotta love Field that. Field replaceable. Yeah. Two power supply uh, per switch, like capacity of doing that. So you can either use, if you have one single unit, you can either use uh, two power supply to combine the power of those two power supply. Because remember, if we have a 48, 30 watts device, you need 1.5 kilowatt of power to you know, power all those phones in AP. So you are going to need more than one power supply. Or you could also set up the second power supply as a backup one. Or if you have more than one unit and you start stacking them, stack power will allow you to share all that power and give you redundancy and be able to basically power uh, switches with less power supply than you have switches. That's what I'm talking about. That's very cool. So th this over uh, and oh, sorry. One last thing that we have in the back, again, a USB port here. So you can stick a, a oh, thumb drive. Thumb drive. Yeah, thumb drive for you know, basically software image or uploading and like recuperating cool. some data. So the 3750X is, is a new improvement on our stackable series. It features everything you know about the E-series. We are line rate, IPv6 ready and uh, basically what we do with that is we've added a lot of those new features that require the hardware uh, enhancement like PUE Plus, Module, and Stack Power. Jeff, that's awesome, man. This is, uh, this is definitely more than just a, a, a marketing upgrade. This is a true uh, piece of engineering, and uh, I really appreciate you coming on the show, man. My awesome, pleasure, Awesome, Jimmy. awesome product. Thank you. Thank you.